today we're at a hidden luxury resort discovering Southern Bicol heritage. Getting off the beaten path and going to places that tourists don't normally go to is the best way to absorb the culture. Siama Hotel is owned by an award-winning architect and furniture designer, Milo Naval. The Filipino designer started off as an interior designer before he established Evolve Designs, a company that manufactures contemporary and modern furniture with accessories. This resort is located just outside of Sorsogon City, which is southern Bicol of the Philippines. Siama Hotel was named after the grandfather of the owner, Milo Naval. It's 12,000 peso for two rooms. We're staying in this luxury hotel. Only one way to find out. Let's go. So this place is difficult to find on Google Maps. We found it, it's time to check in. Let's go. So the pool is one of the main attractions here. This thing is beautiful. The front desk told us something happens at sundown. Can't wait to see what happens. Right now we gotta get up to the room. The baggage guys have taken our gear up there. I'm excited to see the inside of these rooms. This is it. <laughs> Man, this place is a hidden treasure. Come on, let's check it out. What do you think, Charlie? Amazing. Man, it's the furniture. It's solid. Like that is, it's solid furniture. The bed is comfortable. Ah, it's kind of mediocre, honestly. But the furniture, just all that wicker. It's kind of neat, the enclosed bed. You get some privacy, obviously, from, from the outside. Nobody can look in and see you in the bed. Big, huge working table. Man, the door rolls smooth. Look at that, we got a balcony, poolside. This place just keeps impressing. It's real. Voila. But they got a big shower head. We'll see if they got hot water this evening. Anyways, that's the room, man. Really, really nice. Simple, clean, I like it. Let's get back outside. That's where the real action is. All right, so we got the whole place to ourselves. Not a bad lunch. Uh, lunch is served a little different here. They get a really short order menu, very simple foods. They cook them here. Everything's already in stock. So I've got the pasta, shrimp pasta. Dinner menu is a lot different. We need to tell them uh, several hours in advance. They're gonna go down to the market, get the fresh seafood, bring all the foods back and cook and prepare us. Let's try the seafood. Taste that, that's very good. You like the food? Yes. <laughs> Continuing that we were talking about, this is a 10 hectare coconut plantation. Most know in the Philippines you have dry season, which is a short period of time, and then rain season, uh, which is much lengthier. Well, we just entered rain season, and it's kind of humid, you're sweating a little, it's great for the skin, but what it does for the environment, it makes everything feel nice. We can hear the birds. There's the birds. They're out there chirping, you can hear insects. It's just so tranquil, you're, you're away from the city. It's beautiful here, we're enjoying it. Let's get inside. That's the front gate when the security shack is up there. Got our driveway coming in and right over here behind us is the front office. So the front office of Siama Hotel is under renovation now. That's, uh, it's kind of temporary shut down, but that's a good thing. Philippines tourism just really opened its borders a couple months ago. That's what's giving them the confidence, I'd imagine, to start spending lots of money to improve everything. So good things are coming all over the Philippines, just not for this hotel. Let's go peek inside and see if uh, we can see what they're doing. Don't know if we're allowed to, but come on. Shh. 
And so, uh, sir, you, you, you're an architect, and that's your foundation of where you get all your ideas, and you're the designer here? I'm the designer here. I'm an industrial designer. Actually, I, uh, we are more into furniture designing and manufacturing. Okay. What the concept of the hotel is more like a home. As you can see, you ent you're entering like vegetated uh, landscape uh, place, no? So mm -hmm. this was the idea was uh, to put up a place that is more like a home than a hotel. You know? So the dining area was designed in a way it's kind of communal. In one dining table, guests can interact <laughs> with each other. The place has no TV, television inside the room. We wanted everybody to like detach from the usual communication everywhere. Yes. We're going to do some more uh, filming and more adventure around your place. Yeah. I'm sure uh, I'd like to meet you again. I think we'll have some more questions. See you around. Okay, my friend. Thank you. Siama Hotel is isolated here in a 10 hectare coconut plantation. We're finding the trees, walking the trails. It's cool. The hotel has its own restaurant and bar in the lobby. It's a function room that can be reserved for large groups with all of its lengthy tables. From there, you can see the beautiful swimming pool. Not having painted walls gives the building a modern look and feel. It's also reminiscent of provincial homes, which are not typically painted in this area. The better beaches are actually just located 15 minutes east of here, such as Halibang Bye Bye Beach, it's a beautiful beach from what we can see so far. White sandy beaches, a little bit of rock here and there, nothing too big. Who wants wine or beer? <laughs> I think I found the cooler. Again, this guy makes all of this. This gentleman, this architect, Naval, he, uh, he designs the concepts and then he has a manufacturing plant up in Manila. Not only does it look native with the smooth finished concrete, but he's using a lot of the natural and native products within the Philippines, so that's good for their economy versus sending the money out abroad. So anyways, we're gonna get on to the next place. This is by far one of the best resorts I've ever been. It is so humble and is so beautiful. It's a disconnect from the world and reality. In fact, we don't even find televisions in the room. That's part of the concept, that's the design. There's an incomparable pleasure staying in a serene, isolated place being one with nature. Sorsogon, a coastal province in the Bicol region located in the southernmost part of Luzon, is the home of the infinite wonders such as the Mount Bulasan, Subic Beach, and Pagu Riron Island. In this province, you can also experience a whale shark interaction in the municipality of Donsol. When in Sorsogon for a vacation, you have to see this artistic heaven that will let you experience the serenity in the middle of a forest. Siema Hotel. Whether you stay in a resort like this or a different one anywhere in the Philippines, the best part about it is disconnecting. It takes a little bit of self-discipline to leave your gadgets up in the room, but you can just tap into nature, become a part of nature. We sit out here all morning listening to birds, insects, all kinds of great things. Anyways, folks, we're gonna wrap this up. This resort was amazing. Whether you stay at this one or another one, don't forget, downsize in life and don't forget to detox. Get away from social media, the internet. I know that's counter to what you're watching right now. Get to the basics of life, this is it. Till then, my friend, we love you, we appreciate you. There's gonna be some videos up top that Google thinks you like, some playlists down below, big round button, smash that round button, hit the like. We love you, we'll see you soon.